camps abandoned, but a lot of this damage is recent. Guess I arrived just a little too late. Should look around still. Signs of a fight. Paw prints, beastly ones, that's clear. Just on this spot, though. Hmm. Aerial attack. Must have been. Blood. Of the fresh variety. Monster attack was recent. Man. Bled to death. Big beast inflicted these wounds. Clear from the claw marks. Must have a toothy smile, too, judging by what ripped his throat open. Draconid. Gotta be. Maybe a basilisk? Except these prints don't belong to any variety I know. Just a little different. Area's dangerous. I'd say there's a basilisk nesting around here. You'd be wise to remain at some distance. Yes, I'm familiar with the matter. And quite proud to say a basilisk does nest here. I look after it personally. Look after it? It's not exactly a pet. Beasts murdering folk who come through here. Just a minute. It does not murder those who do not trespass upon its territory. You post those warnings? Indeed. To prevent anyone from coming to any harm. Well, a lot of good they did. Got a freshly mangled corpse right here. Most likely a merchant, the poor bloke. Just today, I learned two traders had chosen this route despite the signs. I came as quick as I could to warn them. Too late, alas. I've instructed my servants. They shall take the body, return it to the family with a generous sum as recompense. family's compensation? Why? These lands have been my family's for decades, granted to us by Duchess Ademarta. Beyond them, the basilisk ventures not, hunts not, it does not kill or destroy. Provided it is not provoked. Yet if it does destroy, if it kills, I compensate all for their loss from my own coffers. <sighs> Your coffers? Got a store of sons and husbands in there to compensate for those shredded by your beast? Naturally, I cannot revive the dead, but I do make generous restitution to their loved ones. Just last summer, I paid a leather tooler's widow 800 crowns, this unfortunate merchant's family, to be duly indemnified as well. Claim this to be the last surviving basilisk? How do you figure? The last of this subspecies. Their population was much larger at one time, see? Before the beech forests were felled. Mean to suggest a direct correlation between beechwood forest density and basilisk populations? Indirect, I prefer to contend. Beechwood forests are the chief habitat of roe deer, you see. In turn, a staple of the basilisk diet. When roe deer grew scarce, basilisks made humans their staple food. Enter the witchers. And thus, we've come to this one last specimen. It's a female. As recently as last year, we still had two. But your cast's mate passed on, alas. Your cast? Should she not have a name? My father dubbed her in honor of my dear departed mother. Your cast was brooding then. Two eggs that she cast from her nest, alas, when the male perished. Who exactly are you? And how do you develop such an interest in the beast? Count Borges, happy to be of service. As to the beast, well, this subspecies is our dynastic symbol. The Desalfareses have for centuries signed with the Regulus Platinum. As family legend has it, a female of the species rescued an ancestor, a boy at the time, from a burning building. 
she took the tyke back to her nest, where she fed him as if he were one of her own youngsters. Malarkey. To be sure, but beautiful malarkey it is. Where's the basilisk nesting? Any idea? Of course I have an idea. But you don't really expect me to tell you. Those are not toy swords. I know your intentions. Find it myself, then. Easy to track with its distinct paw prints. Mentioned two merchants. So I might also look for the other corpse. Basilisk scales are usually thicker, not nearly so fine. Could be more sensitive to fire, this one. Alas, it is true. Your cast has a terrible fear of fire. She's a highly sensitive creature. Rid your mind of any thought to kill her. You would destroy the last of a species. Strange. These burn marks. Beast venom make them? Subspecies must be highly toxic. It is so indeed. From a sterling basilisk festers long. Need to brew a potion that'll neutralize that. Busted barrels. Contents spilled all over. Must have been tannin in there. Used to treat leather. Beast smashed the barrels. That's how the scent got on the scale. Yo Coco is so very curious. Strong scents especially intrigue her. The barrels, they must have drawn her in. Drawn her to the caravan. Busted barrels slimed with venom. Hallmarks of an attack. Basilisk must have caught the second victim here. Anyway, got two scents. Venom and tannin. Ought to be enough to track the beast. Why track her at all? Your cast is protected. Her death would forever destabilize the ecosystem. Who knows what would happen? I see unforeseeable consequences down the line. Simply refrain from provoking her. Harm her not, and she too will leave you untouched. I've long suspected they do it on purpose, sent their goods. They seek to lure the basilisk to destroy their wares. It allows them to demand compensation from their assurers. Poor man. A horrid death, truly. dispersed. Seems to be everywhere. Basilisk must be high in the sky. Blood stains. Clear as day. Sense perceptible again. Just as I expected, second victim, but relatively unscathed. Basilisk must have been dragging him back to its nest for later. Dropped him for some reason. Wonder why. something, but it's no basilisk screech. Human voices? Yamo, Harry, prepare the equipment. Beast wandered off somewheres. We got to lure it back. And who might you be? Funny. About to ask you the same. 
They call us the Reavers. Reavers? Wouldn't happen to hail from Crinfrid, would you? Aye, we do. But how's it you know? And again, who the hell are you? Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Know your brethren in arms. Bold, Kennet and Desperate, new boy too. Ah, you're that witcher. Aye, Boho mentioned you. Said you swing a mean sword. A professional. Good, you came along. Could take on the brute together. Talk is the venom's something horrifying. Could use another pair of hands. Fee what we've gotten from the guild. We'll share it fair and square. You in? Gentlemen, this hurts my ears and pains my heart. You aim to kill your cast? It cannot be. The creature is protected. If you fear to lose the guild's reward, I shall repay it and reward you doubly to leave the beast be. You cannot slay the last living specimen of a near-extinct subspecies. Willing to pay, are you? Long as we do nothing? That's rather novel. What say you to that, master? Far as I know, beasts culled the human race by five already. Basilisk lives for now. We're not gonna kill it. A witcher defending a beast. Ever seen that, lads? You like them peaches? Ah, uh, No scrapping with filth today, it seems. But, but, you made some mention of coin, as I recall. I did indeed. And the word once given... Your share, witcher. <laughs> Easiest job I've ever done. Godspeed, Witcher. Strange working with you. Strange, but nice. Godspeed, boys. You spared your cast. I thank you. And be assured, I'll take great care she not dine on any other souls. Gotta try harder. Figure out a way to keep folk out of this area. That I shall do. Master, you must accept more, be it a symbolic sum. Had you not come along, the Reefers would surely have slain my Yokast. Thanks. Yokast has flown her nest. Must have sensed a threat. Likely to return eventually, though. She'll return. Always does. I suspect I might even know where she's gone. I tracked her away and believe she might have found a new mate. It's an ordinary basilisk, not a silvery one. But something might come of it. Who knows? Your cast could lay new eggs. Perhaps produce an entirely new crossbreed. Sure hope not. Take care.
Stench. That's it, Roach. Come on. That's it, Roach.
You dare to get me? Me? You stand no chance against us. Not right. Come on. What now, you piece of shit? I'd stomp wine with that one. We would stomp till we were red and sweaty. Oh, Geralt, I knew you'd save us. A job is like a lady. You can always get a new one. Hey there, Witcher! Come, we must speak! Were it not the werewolf? <laughs> Did you kill it? Mm -hmm. It murdered folk, devoured sheep, ravaged the farm. Oh, what a relief that's done with. I thank you. If you wish, I shall give you a trim. I just need a moment. My hands are still shaking.
What's a barber do on a farm like this? He shears sheep, because sheep are calm, unlikely to scream at him if a lock is out of place or a color a touch off the desired shade. And here, no one threatens to shorten you by a head if you trim a bit too much. Somebody threatened to do that to you? To me? No. But, well, one hears things. I found it impossible to work under incessant pressure. When I saw the notice, urgent specialist sheep shearer sought, well, I didn't give it a second thought. And it was pleasant at first, but then that werewolf appeared. Take care now. You, Witcher, that werewolf. <gasps> My, he'd have devoured us all.
kinds of enemies. <laughs> My goodness! How I enjoy a good man for you! You're not a complete man! Oh. Prepare to be thoroughly flubbered! <laughs> Let's 
Let's end this. Magic! Sorcery of some kind! That Philibert von Witten. Four fingers. How did he wind up with the monarch? Drink! He had Give four me a fingers. Drink. Well, that's a bum load of hell. I know he was missing one. What I don't know is how he lost it. We didn't talk about it nearly ever. He didn't like to. Once he claimed some wrench had bit it off. But he was struck, so it was probably... Oh, not! Thing. My hand shakes so bad, I cannot hold my tools. Stocks and the whip await those running riot. Which of oh, the dodgy values peace and quiet. quiet. The guard Why brings peace to our domains. Flout its writ and rot in chains. <sighs> Master Witcher, 
Might I have a moment, please? Justin, jewel encrusted Galligaskins, the latest rage. Most honored Witcher, the slaughter of Filbert Fourfingers von Witten. Quite the feat. You've my respect and gratitude forever and always. She'd squatted in those ruins for months, him and that hunts of his. Whoever they captured alive lived to regret not having been cleaved in battle. Managed to assemble a pretty good bunch of men. Refuse from all the world. Bandits, degenerates, drawn like flies to doo-doo. It's good you fell them to a man. You've my gratitude, and good prices for all time here. Seems the Hansa was prepared for a long siege. Oh, yes. The rats had woven quite a nest. Some knights errant took swipes at them, but cracked their claws on those ruins. Not surprised. Von Witten turned that rubble into a fortress. With a ballista in the lower courtyard, no less. Well... That machine was most like there to fight off the winged lizards. A whole host live in these hills. Alert eye on the sky at all times, Witcher. Your goods. Mind if I have a glance? Farewell. Good luck on your path. Master Witcher! Might I have a moment, please? Say it, you all that you have death! Did you have death? Nothing to see here! Let's get the beast! A Witcher! Come me fling, I'm off to the bells, quick as a flash. Those girls are trolling on an empty ah. stomach. Oof, dreadful. What's new, handsome knight? A job is like a lady. You can always get a new one. Tiny with honey. I don't know why. Where you step, fool. Good luck on your path. Now there is a hero. Move it. Stocks and the whip await those running riot. Our dodgy values, peace and quiet. Keep calm. Darks, no pros.
Giddy up.